It takes highly specialized engineering skills to build a structure 54 meters tall and 16 meters in diameter. Now, imagine doing that in the Fraser River, near the Alex Fraser Bridge. The circular structure is called a coffer dam. It's a temporary enclosure that goes down beneath the riverbed. It houses a critical part of a new outfall pipe system connected to the Anasis Island Wastewater Treatment Plant in Delta. The treatment plant already has an outfall, which is an underground pipe that carries the treated wastewater to the river. The new outfall tunnel will be nearly a kilometer long and is being built over several years. The reason we're building the new outfall is that the existing outfall has reached its capacity. It's too small. Uh, it's basically about population. With so much population growth in the region, there's a lot more effluent being generated, sewage. Construction of the new outfall is taking place 40 meters below ground from the treatment plant to the middle of the Fraser River. The coffer dam began construction in 2020. Steel sheet piles were installed vertically into the riverbed to form a circle 16 meters in diameter. Then the coffer dam was reinforced with rebar cages. In February 2022, it was time to install the river riser. It's a massive structure that will be embedded into the bottom of the river, attached to the new outfall pipe. Lifting and lowering it into the coffer dam took months of planning. The River Riser weighs about 245,000 kilograms. Um, and just to put it into perspective, that weight equates to about 40 African elephants. And the crane that they brought in is one of the largest in Western Canada. It's got about a 600 ton capacity. In the water, divers helped guide the River Riser precisely into place. There was no room for error here. Up on the surface, the busy Fraser River sees lots of marine traffic, requiring constant communication from project engineers. Earlier, there was a massive container ship that went by, so everybody that uses the river uh, in that capacity is informed. A few weeks after the river riser was installed, concrete was poured around it. The concrete was pumped from land through a long pipe laid across barges. Next steps include finishing the tunnel that will run from Anasis Island Wastewater Treatment Plant to this location in the river.